Hello, welcome to our classes. I am Dr. K. K. Misra. This video tutorial is on multiple choice questions on financial mathematics. This is part 4. Now come to the question. Hello, question number 1. The relation between effective annual rate of interest R E and nominal rate of interest R is best represented by the correct option is B R E is equal to 1 plus R by M to whole to the power M minus 1. Two, to find the present value of a sum of rupees 10,000 to be received at the end of each year for the next 5 years at 10% rate, we use correct option is B, present value of annuity table. 3. Sinking fund factor is the reciprocal of correct option is D, future <coughs> value interest factor of an annuity. 4. According to the rule of 69, doubling period of an investment at an interest rate of 15% is needs to be calculated here correct option will be c 4.95 years 5 if the effective rate of interest compounded quarterly is 16 percent then the nominal rate is rate of interest will be correct option is d 15.12 percent 6 if the interest rate on a loan is 1 percent per month the effective annual rate of interest is here correct option is C 12.68 percent. 7. If a loan of rupees 30,000 is to be paid in 5 annual installments with interest rate at of 12 percent per annum, then the equal annual installment will be here correct option is need to be calculated correct option is D rupees 8,320. 8. X took a housing loan of rupees 25 lakhs. The loan is to be redeemed in 120 monthly installments of rupees 31,000 each to be paid at the end of each month. What is the implied interest rate per annum? After calculation here, correct option you will find B A that is 8.5 percent. 9. The difference between effective annual rate of interest with monthly and quarterly compounding when nominal rate of interest is 10 percent will be here cut off in is <coughs> d 0.09 percent 10 a bond has a face value of rupees 1000 and a coupon rate of 10 percent it will be redeemed after four years at 10 percent premium find the present value of bond at a required rate of 12 percent so a cut option is a 1002.8 11 Axis Bank offers 10 percent nominal interest rate for a three year fixed deposit to senior citizens if the compounding is done quarterly, the effective annual rate of interest is a correct option is B 10.38%. 12. X deposits rupees 2500 at the end of every month in a bank for 5 years. If the interest rate offered by bank is 8% per annum compounded monthly, the accumulated sum X will be will get after 5 years will be a correct option is B rupees. 1,83,692. 13. Invest rupees 1,500 at the end of year 1 and rupees 2,000 at the end of second year and rupees 5,000 each year from 3rd to 10th. Find the present value of a stream at discount rate of 10%. So, here character option is A rupees 25,062. 14. If you take a load of rupees 1 lakh today and return rupees 151807 after 4 years to clear off the loan what effective annual rate is paid by you so the correct option is c 11 per 15 in how much period rupees 1 becomes rupees 3 at 12 percent rate of interest compounded annually so the correct option is d 9.69 percent obviously needs to be calculated that formula in all the cases just remains the one annuity formula now 16 which of the following statements is true so the correct option is d cash flows are occurring in different time periods cannot be compared unless they are discounted to a common date 17 if a 12 percent loan is to be paid back after 10 years the sinking fund factor will be equal to the correct option is b 0.05698 18. Mr. X has decided to deposit rupees 70,000 per year in his public provident fund account for next 15 years. At 8% interest 
compounded annually how much money will accumulate in his accounts so here correct option is a that is 19 lakhs 648 19 if a bank offers to double your money in 8 years what is the effective rate of interest so the correct option is d 9.05% 20 an investment of rupees 5000 in a deep discount bond will re return rupees 1 lakh in 20 years find the interest rate implicit in the offer correct option is d 16.159% 21 a machine is to be replaced after 5 years when it is expected to cost rupees 10 lakh, how much equal sum should be set aside and invested at the end of each year at 12% per annum to accumulate the desired sum? The correct option is B, rupees 1 lakh 57,410. So, this was all about this particular video tutorial. I hope that you have liked it, and if you have liked it, please do not forget to subscribe my YouTube channel, our classes, and press the bell button and passed on to others those who are needy now and in the future thank you like share and subscribe thank you very much have a nice time best of luck